Hello children, hello, how are you all? Today I am going to teach you a new rhyme. See, this is Humpty Dumpty. The name of the egg is Humpty Dumpty. He sat on this wall. He was sitting. Suddenly he fell down. So they called the king's man and king's horses. But once the egg is broken, we can't replace it. Is it? Shall we start the rhyme? I will say the rhyme. You repeat after me. Okay? Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses, all the king's men could not put Humpty Dumpty together again. I will repeat. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses, all the king's men could not put Humpty Dumpty together again. Children, practice this song, this rhyme at home with actions. Okay? Thank you. Bye bye. Chart reading of letter I. I for ice cream. We all love ice cream. I for ice cream. I for igloo. Igloo is a house made up of snow. It is also called snow house. I for igloo. Igloo. I for ink pot. I for ink pot. I is for ink pot. I for iron. Iron is used to iron the clothes. I for iron. For iron. I for insect. I for insect. What is this children? Insect. I for ice cream. I for igloo. I for ink pot. I for iron. Chart reading of letter J. J for jeep. We can roam around in a jeep. For jug, we keep water in a jug. J for jam, jam is sweet. J for Joker. Joker makes us laugh. Joker. J for Jar. We can keep any food items in a jar. J for Jar. J for Jeep, J for Jug, J for Jam, J for Joker. Let's do the chart reading of letter K. K for Kite. Kite can fly high in the sky. K for Key. Key is used to open the lock. K. K for Kangaroo. Kangaroo hop from one place to another. Kangaroo. K for 
kettle kettle is used to serve tea or coffee k for knee what is this children leg and this part is called as knee so k for knee k for knee k for kite k for key k for kangaroo k for kettle chattering of letter l l for lion lion is the king of the jungle lion is the king of the jungle l for l for lemon yellow lemon lemon is sour in taste lemon is sour in taste L for lemon L for lamp lamp gives us light L for lamp L for leaf leaf is green in color L for lock. Lock is used to close the doors or to lock the door. L for lion. L for lemon. L for lamp. L for leaf. Last time we have learned about wild animals and today we are going to learn about some pet animals and some domestic animals these are the animals which can live along with the human race domestic animals are useful for us in one way or the other and pet animals can live along with us in our house now we'll have a look over here what is this this is a cow c for cow c for cow and cow gives us milk and cow says moo moo what is this this is a horse h for horse h for horse a horse runs very fast and a horse neighs and the horse neighs do you know children in olden days horse is the only mode of transport and now what is this this is dog d for dog d for dog a dog is a man's best friend and it protects our house and the dog says woof woof and what is this this is a cat this is a cat c for cat and the cat says meow meow and what is this this is a sheep this is a sheep a sheep gives us wool milk and meat do you know children ba ba black sheep have you any wool and the sheep says me me and here comes monkey what is this this is a monkey and the monkey jumps from one tree to another we have a rhyme children five little monkeys jumping on a bed okay children learn to identify the animals this is a cow cow horse horse dog dog cat cat sheep sheep monkey monkey thank you children now coming to the gk once again we'll revise days of the week okay children 
How many days are there in a week? Yes, there are seven days in a week. They are, now I will show you. What is this? Sunday. What is this children? Sunday. What comes after Sunday? Monday. Sunday, Monday. Next, what comes after Monday? Tuesday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. What comes after Tuesday? Wednesday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. What comes after Wednesday? Thursday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Next, Friday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and the last day of the week is Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Okay, you have to practice days of the week daily. Understand? Next, parents, uh, learning days of the week are very important for children. To understand, I will give you some tips to teach days of the week for your little ones. Okay. For example, every day you ask uh, three questions. That is, what is today? If suppose it is Wednesday, ask your child, what is today? They will answer Wednesday. Next. Then, what will be tomorrow? Yes, Thursday. And yesterday was? It is Tuesday. In this way, if you ask these three questions, it will, uh, uh, this tip will help them a lot to learn days of the week very quickly. Okay. Now let us revise once again in our GK textbook. Come. There are seven days in a week. They are? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Once again, how many days are there in a week? There are seven days in a week. They are, while answering, you have to start from the first line. Okay, you have to say the full sentence also. There are seven days in a week. They are Sunday, Monday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. You have to practice daily children. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. Now sing a song and enjoy. Dance with my hands. I can dance with my feet. I like to dance every day. Seven days a week. I can dance with my hands. I can dance with my feet. I like to dance every day. drum every day seven days a week i can drum with my hands i can drum with my feet i like to drum every day seven days a week sundays mondays tuesdays wednesdays thursdays fridays saturdays sundays mondays tuesdays wednesdays thursdays fridays saturdays sundays mondays tuesdays wednesdays thursdays fridays saturdays sundays mondays tuesdays